Hi all, welcome to this predicted marquee matchup prediction for the 11th of October. This is just the UCL ones again, um, just to give you guys, just kind of keeping ahead really, and at the same time just keeping us, ourselves ahead, because you never know what to expect. You can throw it in one week and then they don't, and then they do, and then it's like, we're so used to it, and like... I think because he are so inconsistent with it, it's just never ideal. Now, obviously, we ran through it for the fourth. We're not going to waste too much time with this one, folks. Um, obviously, this is just the reverse fixtures, so I'll just run through them all again, and we'll just take it from there, as I said, for the main ones that um, stand out, as it were. So, Bayern, please then, Marseille, Sporting, Porto, Leverkusen, Club Bruges, Atletico, Ajax, Napoli, Frankfurt, Spurs, Inter, Barcelona, Liverpool, Rangers, Salzburg, Dynamo, Leipzig, Celtic, Chelsea, Milan, Real Madrid v Shakhtar, Sevilla Dortmund, Benfica PSG, Man City Copenhagen. Obviously, it's the reverse way of it. Um, like so, like, please end Bayern and all that. But I've just done it that way. Just it was just for quickness when I was um putting them all together. Obviously, when we say that for the fourth of October's ones, the main ones that we felt um stood out the most were Frankfurt Spurs, Inter Barca, Liverpool Rangers, Chelsea v EC Milan, Sevilla v Dortmund, um kind of like our main ones and you could give like attention to Marseille Sport and um, Ajax Napoli um, as well if you, if you want to be really honest and it's kind of the same applies here again really um, but I would say personally at the moment it's just a win see game that's all it can really be um, but as long as you're just preparing like as long as your club stocked with half a dozen games um, regardless, because obviously if you've been opening packs, as long as you've not been like rinsing it in the upgrades and losing some of these players, then you're fine. But yeah, that's kind of the way I would kind of approach it really. Just keep it quite simple, nothing too strenuous. As long as you've at least got a couple of players from half a dozen of those games, um, you should be well and truly sorry. But let me know folks um, what you're going to go for. As I say, it's just a short one, just with how everything's playing out um, with content in the game. But as I say, if you let me know what you're kind of going for, if you're going to be prepared for this nonetheless, because you never know what to expect with EA. Smash likes always sub to channel if you know, and I will catch you all later.